lot of interference in terms of how our temples are run, in terms of even misappropriation of funds that were meant for temples. And on top of this, there is scant regard or there is blatant disregard for court orders as well. You know? Is there, if the legal remedies are you know, not an option, or they are not an option, but what, what are the other things that we can possibly do? See, uh, at, at this stage, I don't think Tamil Nadu and Telangana are passing that issue. They are almost in the same boat. Some more volume. So, I'm so sorry. I said Telangana and Tamil Nadu are almost in the same boat. And uh, Telangana is perhaps even worse, uh, thanks to uh, a certain demographic imbalance. Uh, fortunately, Tamil Nadu has something that Telangana does not have, at least at this point in terms of state. Another way. Pack this gentleman. Give him the human resource support that he needs in terms of intelligent advisors on sensitive issues such as economics and everything else. Because he knows the cultural stuff better than most people. He knows what he's doing. He doesn't need advisors on that front. Just make sure that his team is uh, well rounded. That's what I would work towards in terms of supporting people who are capable of canonizing the crowds. As someone who's done his engineering from Kwanatur, I'm so proud that the Land of Congo has actually produced this engine. So proud of it. No wonder the bombast took place there. No wonder the so-called cylinder accident took place there. <laughs> right? So he's doing something right. Protect him, defend him, and guide him. I don't say this to infantilize him or to be patronizing. I'm saying that when someone's operating at that level, it's possible that they